bumped up a couple degrees today with our highs. We had a high of 75 degrees here in Lafayette and a high of 72 degrees up in Chalmers. Mainly temperatures were in the lower to mid 70s across the region. Taking a look at our satellite and radar, we have this rain still lingering around the area. We're actually dealing with sprinkles ready, really. These rain showers will subside as we go past midnight especially. But taking a look at Precision, really just dealing with sprinkles. Most of the rain is off just west, off of Rensselaer. Other than that, much of the area is staying dry. But future cash, we do see some rain showers lingering around midnight or so. Those will push out and then we'll start to see mostly cloudy skies all the way till Monday morning. That's when we'll start off. We'll have a dry start to Monday. So once again, we get a brief break from the rain, but it does return once we get to tomorrow afternoon. But we have a soggy extended forecast and also cooler temperatures are here to stay for at least the first part of the week. Downtown Lafayette, we are staying dry. Temperature 68 degrees with cloudy skies. Winds coming from the north northeast at 10 miles per hour. We're going to fall into the upper 50s across the region. 59 for Lafayette, 58 Delphi, 57 in Monticello, and 55 degrees up in Winnemac. By daybreak tomorrow, temperatures are going to be in the 60s, and we're also going to stay dry. Winds coming from the northeast at 5 to 10 miles per hour. 60 by 5 in the morning, 62 by 7, and 65 degrees by 9 a.m. We will have a high into this mid-70s for the area. 76 for Monticello, 77 Winnemac, 77 in Remington, and 74 degrees down in Crawfordsville. Here in Lafayette, we'll have a high of 76 degrees. Once again, we have a chance for an isolated afternoon thunderstorm and maybe even some showers. Winds coming from the northeast between 10 to 15 miles per hour. Showing this with our future cast, we'll start Monday morning. Once again, just dealing with mostly cloudy skies. Even through lunch, we're going to stay dry. But once we get past that lunch hour, we start to see lots of rain push in. I would say until the evening hours. Then we start to dry up and get another break. And this shows Tuesday at midnight staying dry. But taking a look at the next seven days, we are going to be dealing with quite a bit of rain. Tuesday will have a high of 75 degrees with, once again, chance for scattered thunderstorms. Same with Wednesday with a high of 77 degrees. Then we climb up to 80 degrees once again by Thursday, dealing with thunderstorms. Once we get to Friday, we will have a break from all that rain high of 82 degrees, but once we get into Saturday, we still have a chance for a thunderstorm, 30% chance with a high of 83 degrees, and by Sunday, a high of 81 with a chance of thunderstorms. I don't want to scare anyone with all these thunderstorms. These are really going to be hit and miss. Tuesday looks really the worst day out of the whole week, and we're going to have a cool start at least to the week in the lower or upper 70s, which